Ladies and gentlemen, thank you all for joining us today with Freaks Plays. No, no, that's Wolf. Wolf does that. I don't know. We're gonna do some Let's Play. This is episode... Five? Six? It's an episode. So without further ado, let's, uh, let's go fight Papyrus again. Move, Mr. Bear. Grillbees. Oh god, I just realized by playing this game, that means I have to do the voices again. Yeah. Yeah. And now we're going to walk into the mist. Because I forgot to save. So we're just going to fast forward this part in editing. Yeah. All right, Papyrus, come betray me, you pasta-loving, backstabbing bitch! Human, allow me to tell you about some complex- All right, fuck it, I already read all this in, at the end of last episode. There we go. Let's do this. I can't talk my way out of it. Yeah, bitch. Oh! Oh! I forgot about that. Oh, he blue balled me. I really don't care that much. How high can I jump? I can jump to the moon and back! Just kidding. Dude, dude. But, I got better from last time. Continue to consider your options, Papyrus. You're fucked! I know how to jump. Do you know how to jump? You're just all bone. Nah. Smells like bones. I wonder if I can beat him, because last night he beat me. Don't make me use my special attack. Bring it on, bro. I'll play your flappy bones. Oh, dear God. The virus is cackling. Oh, that was an awful attack. I can almost taste my future popularity. You taste nothing except for the spaghetti that you shattered our friendship with. Oh. 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 Nailed it. Ow! Papyrus is considering his options some more. He's terrified of me. He's gonna run. Head of the Royal Guard, dude, you got huge ambitions, and I admire that. I fucked up. There we go. You're trying hard to play it cool? You can't play it cool when you're with somebody else this cool. Papyrus, a parallel spaghettor! Dude, you wanna talk about a spaghetti poor? Damn it! I gotta stop. Rattle your bones. Rattle them bones at me, big boy. Nine will be really proud of me. Ooh. Dude, really? Papyrus is trying hard to play it cool. Spaghetti or Skeletor. I'm done. Ow. You prepare that bone attack. Give me that big bone! I'm super spiffy! I'm number one! Ow. I'm not number one at jumping, though. Collect a failure? That's a me! Pyrus is preparing a bone attack still! I'm gonna beat you, Papyrus. You're not gonna get a chance to lock me in the, uh, cellar. Oh, shit. Shit. 
just like a platformer. Behold my special attack! It's a popper! What the heck? That's my special attack! Hey! You stupid dog! Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone! Hey! What are you doing? Come back here with my special attack! Oh well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Here's an absolutely normal attack. Because I don't want to kill him. I like Papyrus. He, he's funny. Except for the fact that he betrayed me over spaghetti. God damn it, I suck at this. I don't think I'm going to kill him anyway. Yep, yep. I accept my fate. Hey, dog! Cool, dude. <laughs> Uh-oh. I just keep going up. That was cool. Well, oh, it's clear. You can't uh, defeat me. You can't defeat me either with my one HP left. Yeah, I can see you shaking in your boots. Therefore I, the great Papyrus, I like to grant you pity. I will spare you, human. Now that's not how this game works, okay? I have the spare option, like right... Over here! Now's your chance to accept my mercy. Papyrus is sparing you. Can I just flirt with you? Too busy fighting the flirt back. Fine. I'll spare you. Can we be spaghetti friends again? Spaghetti friends are the best friends! Yeah, I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undyne's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and my friend Quantity will remain stagnant. What should you say? Let's be friends! We're spaghetti buddies! Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess... I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wow, I have friends! And who knew? All I needed to do to make them was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them. You taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through, and I'll give you directions to the surface. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cabin. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier! That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. Like you! Alright, I cannot keep doing the voice, guys. That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I almost forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters. He is, well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I'm certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and hang out. The cheesecake looks great. Dang, I am looking forward to eating it. I'm jealous. Alright, so after that, I'm gonna go hang out with him. Maybe he's gonna make me some spaghetti. Ba -da -da -ba -ba -da -ba. So you came back to see me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. The library? Nope. The bar? My house! Really? Bruh. Bruh. Alright, fuck it. It would appear this is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. Aw, he actually feeds it. That's sweet. Something is flooding upstairs there, buddy. Impressed? I increased the height of my sink. Now I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. POPPERS! <laughs> what? Catch that meddling canine! 
No. <gasps> Curses. Ah, there's sands. Stop plaguing my life with incidental music. My brother always goes out to eat, but recently he tried baking something. It was like a quiche, but filled with sugary non-egg substance. How absurd. A pie? There's an empty pie tin inside the stove. Aha! Interested in my food museum? Please, peruse my culinary art show. Half the fridge is filled with containers all labeled spaghetti. I'm so happy! The other half contains nothing but an empty bag of chips. That's the trash can. Feel free to visit it any time. You guys have a little gaming system right here? It's a dirty sock with a series of notes on it. Sans, please pick up your sock. Okay. Don't put it back down. Move it. Okay. You moved it two inches. Move it to your room. Okay. And don't bring it back. Okay. It's still here. Didn't you just say not to bring it back to my room? Forget it. Oh my god. Oh, it's my favorite game show. It says stay tuned for a new program, MTT. What? It's usually better than this. This is just a bad episode. Don't judge me. It's a joke book. Take a look inside. Yeah, let's learn some jokes. Inside the joke book was a quantum physics book. Okay. You look inside. Inside the quantum physics books was another joke book. That makes more sense. You look inside. There's another quantum phys- You decide to stop. Thank you. That's my room. If you finish looking around, we could go in and hang out like a pair of very cool friends. I think Papyrus is trying to fuck me. A classic image. It always reminds me of what's important in life. Bones, which is also another word for... The door is locked. I want to know why it's flooding. Let's go hang out, Papyrus! Cause you're a cool guy. Dude, he's got a race car bed! Yeah! That's my bed! If I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair, sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead, I cruise while I snooze. I like it. Alright, what else we got going on here? Hey, those are all the attacks I used on you. Great memories, huh? Seems like it was only yesterday, even though it basically just happened. Yeah, dude, it was like a T minus 17 oh, seconds ago. Yeah. Isn't that flag neato? Undyne found it at the bay. I think it's from the human world. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why would a human flag have a cool skeleton on it? Well, I have a theory. I think humans must have descended from skeletons. Yeah, 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 yeah. Ah, yes. Action figures. A great reference for theoretical battle scenarios. How do I have so many? Well, let's just say they're from a chubby, smiling man who loves to surprise people. Yeah, that's right. Santa! That book's one of my favorites. Advanced puzzle construction for critical minds. That next book's another one of my favorites. Peekaboo with a fluffy bunny. The ending always gets me. The internet! I'm quite popular there. I'm just a dozen away. From a double digit follower count. Aww. Aww. Of course, fame has a steep price. A jealous troll was has besieged my online persona, always sending me bad puns in a goofy font. Who could that be? The computer's internet browser is open to a social media site. What's out here? There are no skeletons inside my closet, except me sometimes. Look in the closet? Hell yeah! Clothes are hung up neatly inside. Oh, that was disappointing. Can I just talk to you, Papyrus? Can I get to know you, my spaghetti-loving friend? So, um, if you've seen everything, do you want to start hanging out? Begin the hangouts? We're hanging out! Okay, let's hang ten! Hangout start. Here we are, hanging out! I've actually never done this before, but don't worry. You can't spell prepared without several letters from my name. I snagged an official hangout guidebook from the library. We're ready to have a great time. Let's see. Step one. 
press the C key on your keyboard for the friendship HUD. Wow. Wow. Wowie, I feel so informed. Look at him, he's so happy. I think we're ready for step two. Oh shit, is he taking me to second base? Step two, ask them to hang out. Ahem. Human! I have the great papyrus. We'll hang out with you. Yes. R really? Wowie, I guess that means it's time for part three. Step three, put on nice clothes to show you care. Wait a second. Wear clothing. That bandage hanging off of you. You're wearing clothing right now. Not only that, earlier today, you were also wearing clothing. No. Could it be? You wanted to hang out with me from the very beginning? Yeah. Look at his face! No! You planned it all! You're way better at hanging out than I am. No, no your friendship power! Yeah. <laughs> Don't think you've bested me yet. I, the Great Papyrus, I've never been beaten at hanging out, and I never will. I can easily keep up with you. You see, I too can wear clothing. In fact, I always wear my special clothes underneath my regular clothes just in case someone wants to hang out. Behold! Sometimes this game requires a little bit of alcohol. I'm gonna be nice. I love your cool dude outfit. Oh, there one, that was the wrong thing. A genuine compliment. I am fucking him up with friendship. However, you don't truly understand the hidden power of this outfit. Therefore, what you just said is invalid. This hangout won't escalate any further unless you find my secret. But that won't happen. Move and inspect with Z. There's no secret to my legs. Just hard work and perseverance. Uh, I wasn't actually clicking on your legs there. Is it those kicks? Those sweet kicks? Human souls are stronger than monster souls, but the souls of our shoes, and on the other hand, are about the same. Is it that you're wearing a basketball on your shoulder? I see, I see. You like caressing my biceps with a floating heart, but who doesn't? My hat? My hat. My hat! Yeah, 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 yeah. Well, well, well then, you found my secret. I suppose I have no choice. It's a present. A present j j just for you. Oh god, it's in his brain. Do I want this shit? Fuck it, we're being nice. We like papyrus. We're spaghetti bros. Do you know what this is? Spaghetti Bros. <laughs> he gets me. That's what you're thinking, isn't it? Right? But oh, so wrong. This ain't any plain old pasta. This is an artisan's work. Silk and spaghetti, finely aged in an oaken cask, then cooked by me, Master Chef Papyrus. Human, it's time to end this. There's no way this can go any further. You take a small bite. Your face reflexively scrunches up. The taste is indescribable. What a passionate expression. You must really love my cooking. And by extension, me. Maybe even more than I do. I just fucked him with friendship. Human, it's clear now. You're completely obsessed with me. Everything you do, everything you say, it's all been for my sake. Human, I want you to be happy too. It's time for me to express my feelings. It's time that I told you. I, Papyrus. Hmm. Well, I'm flattered you care so much, but maybe cool it a little bit? You are a very nice person. I'm glad we're friends, but 
I think you can reach your max potential if you live more for your own sake rather than just for mine. Dude, we were spaghetti bros. Don't break up with me on this again. Hmm? Hey, I know the solution. You should hang out with my boss. Mm -hmm. I think if you spread your friend energy out more, you'll have a more healthy lifestyle. Yeah, let's be friends with Undyne. <laughs> oh, and if you ever need to reach me, here's my phone number. You can call me anytime. You used to call me on my cell phone. Fuck that song. Platonically. Well, gotta go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was the weirdest hangout of my life. That was just unbelievable. I, I just... I don't even know what to say. I'm just gonna... I'm just gonna barrel on then. We'll worry about this later. And walk into oblivion. What's up, guys? Yo! Are you sneaking out to see her, too? Awesome. She's the coolest, right? I want to be just like her when I grow up. Hey, don't tell my parents I'm here. <laughs> this is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. Over and over. This is an echo flower. It repeats the last thing it heard over and over. Sans! What's up, my mans? What? Haven't you seen a guy with two jobs before? Fortunately, two jobs means twice as many legally required breaks. Ah, I'm going to Grilby's. Want to come? Fuck it, let's go drink, man. Well, if you insist, I'll pry myself away from my work. Over here. I know, a shortcut. I was about to say, Grilby's is that way, bro. Fast shortcut, huh? You're telling me! Hey, everyone. Hey, Sans. Hi, Sans. Greetings, Sans. Hiya, Sansy. Hey, Sans, weren't you just here for breakfast a few minutes ago? Nah, I haven't had breakfast in at least half an hour. You must be thinking of brunch. Oh my god. Here, get comfy. Alright. Whoops, watch where you sit down. You motherfucker. Sometimes weirdos put whoopee cushions on the seats. Anyway, let's order. What do you want, fries or a burger? Well, I want fries with a burger. So, oh shit. I've lost it. I lost it. There we go. We're going with a burger. Hey, that sounds pretty good. Groovy, we'll have a double order of burg. So, what do you think? Of my brother. He's cool. Of course he's cool. You'd be cool too if you wore that outfit every day. He'd only take that thing off if he absolutely had to. Oh well, at least he washes it. And by that I mean he wears it in the shower. <laughs> Here comes the grub. Want some ketchup? I don't like ketchup. No, more for me. This motherfucker just downed a bottle of ketchup and scratched his ass. Anyway, cool or not, you have to agree Papyrus tries real hard. Like how he keeps trying to be part of the Royal Guard? One day, he went to the house of the head of the Royal Guard and begged her to let him be in it. Of course, she shut the door on him because it was midnight. <laughs> but the next day, she woke up and saw him still waiting there. Seeing his dedication, she decided to give him warrior training. It's, uh, still a work in progress. I can tell. Oh yeah, I wanted to ask you something. Are you gonna eat that? Have you ever heard of a talking flower? Yeah, Flowey. Tried to fuck me at the beginning. So you know all about it. The Echo Flower. Oh, that, that, that too. They're all over the marsh. Say something to them, and they'll repeat it. What about it? Well, Papyrus told me something interesting the other day. Sometimes, when no one else is around, a flower appears and whispers things to him. Flattery. Advice. Encouragement. Predictions. Weird, huh? Someone must be using an echo flyer to play a trick on him. Keep an eye out, okay? Thanks. Damn, you got all serious there, Sans. 
You didn't even eat your burger. Well, that was a long break. I can't believe I let you pull me away from work for that long. Oh, by the way, I'm flat broke. Can you foot the bill? It's just one... 10,000 G. No. Just kidding. Groby, put it on my tab. By the way, I was going to say something, but I forgot. I hate you. I hate you so much. Alright. Yeah, my food is cold by now. Don't mind me, just gonna make my way back to the edge of the town. Making my way downtown, walking fast, faces past, and I'm homebound. Do -do 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 -do. Terry Crews, do -do 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 -do, with his mipples. Do -do 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 -do. And they jiggle. Do -do 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 -do. All I think of when I hear that song is white girls. Alright, we're gonna hit up this save point and call this episode a fin. Because it's done. Like, finish. Boo, you suck. I know. Thank you, everybody. Feel free to like, subscribe, follow, do whatever. Check out the links in the description below. Let us know what you want to see. And as always, take it easy and stay freaky. You're a freak like me